How is it going everybody? You're watching the Naval Tech. So let's say you forgot your iPhone passcode. And by iPhone passcode, I mean this, the lock screen passcode. So maybe your iPhone is just like mine. It's fully working, but it just forgot the passcode. So you can't get in, you can't actually use it. Or maybe even worse, you have tried it so many times that your iPhone is like that. It's saying, iPhone unavailable, so it's completely locked. So, no matter what, in this video, I'm gonna help you out because today I'm gonna teach you how to reset your lock screen passcode, so how to actually remove it and create a new one. And the coolest thing about this video is that there's a new method that you don't even need a computer for that. All you need is your iPhone and nothing else. So this is absolutely incredible. But before I begin, I have two very important disclaimers. Number one, everything that I'm gonna show you in this video comes straight from Apple support website. This is how Apple recommends us to deal with this situation. So this is super important. Everything here comes from Apple, all right? And two, and this is also very important, this tutorial will only work if the iPhone is yours. If you own the iPhone and you actually have forgotten the lock screen passcode. If the iPhone is not yours, if you're trying to do this on anybody else's iPhone, this will not work. I can't stress this enough. It'll not work. Trust me when I say this, it will only work if the iPhone is yours and you have forgotten the passcode, all right? Now, without further ado, let's begin. As I mentioned before, you don't need a computer for this process. All you need is your iPhone, but, you need to be running iOS 15.2 or newer. So if your iPhone is not updated to 15.2 or newer, please follow this other tutorial that I'll put a card right here. Okay, I'll put a card right there and in the description because you can follow this older method that will work for iPhones that are not updated to 15.2 or newer. This other video will work for any iPhone in any iOS version. So that's super important, all right? But as I said, if you're on iOS 15.2 or newer, you can follow this process without a computer. The other one will require a computer. So in order to reset your lock screen passcode, you need to put your iPhone in security lockout. And to put it in security lockout, you need to actually type it in a wrong passcode a few times. You actually need to type in a wrong passcode until you see try again in 15 minutes. So you need to actually be locked out of your iPhone three times. So let's do this. I'm gonna do it with you. So the first time, all right, so uh, I'm gonna type a wrong passcode on purpose a few times, as you can see here, okay, on purpose until I'm locked out for the first time. So as you guys can see, try again in one minute. That's the first time. And I need to do it another two times. I'm gonna do it again until it says try again in five minutes. And then once again, until it says try again in 15 minutes. And then we'll see right here, security lockout. And then we can get started. So let's wait for this one minute. So the one minute has passed. So let's do it again. So uh, type in the wrong passcode and then try again in five minutes. Now let's wait for those five minutes. And so after the five minutes, we are ready to swipe up, put uh, a wrong passcode once again, tap on OK, and then here we have it, iPhone unavailable, try again in 15 minutes, and we're on the security lockout. And all we have to do is tap on erase iPhone. As you guys can see, we have to go to this screen in order to activate it and in order, in order to have access to erase iPhone. So tap on erase iPhone, and then as you guys can see here, erase all content and settings. Uh, this is a security lockout. As I said before, security lockout. You can try your passcode again in 50 minutes or you can erase and reset your iPhone now. So this is super important. Uh, if we go ahead and proceed and erase iPhone once again, we will need to type in our Apple ID. So as you guys can see, here is my email and I'll type in my password for my Apple ID. And with this, I will, in fact, erase my iPhone. The only way to actually reset a forgotten lock screen passcode and to actually remove it and create a new one is to type your Apple ID. You will need your Apple ID. So that's why I said that's, that this will only work if the iPhone is yours, all right? So type in your Apple ID. 
and then tap on go and erase iPhone. It's gone. So now it's spinning the wheel and I'm actually gonna sign out of my Apple ID to remove activation lock and get this iPhone ready to actually be erased. And then I'll have this iPhone in factory settings. So then I can uh, just set up my iPhone as you would and then you'll have your iPhone back. And then, as you guys can see, it'll automatically start restarting. So uh, it'll just restart Apple logo, and then you'll see right here uh, your loading bar, because this is how the process is gonna go. It's gonna actually erase all the content, all the settings, and then your iPhone will be ready, as I mentioned before. One very important tip is, if you're doing this on a low battery, I do recommend that you go ahead and do this process while plugged into the charger, just so the battery doesn't die throughout the process. But since I had quite a lot of battery, I didn't need to do it, all right? It'll just take a couple minutes, and then I'll be back to you. Another very important thing that you may be asking, oh, so I'll lose all my data? Yes and no. With this process, you will in fact lose all your data, but of course you can recover it all from a backup. So if you have a backup on iCloud or on your computer, you can recover all of your data afterwards, after this process is done, from your backup so then you have your iphone as good as new if you don't have a backup i'm sorry you will in fact lose all your data and you won't be able to recover it because you don't have a backup right but that's the only way to do it i'm sorry about that let's move on and then as you guys can see we go to the hello screen the iphone has finished the process it just takes literally two minutes and then we are ready to go from here on, you can set up your iPhone as you would, as if you got it brand new out of the box for the first time. So then you put your language and then you can move on with your country and region. And here, after a few more steps, is where you can actually recover from a backup. So then uh, if you have a backup, you can recover from a backup and you won't lose any of your data. All right, so that's it. That's how you can actually remove a forgotten lock screen passcode that's the way you do it without a computer, super easy, super fast. And from here on, you can already start using your iPhone, create your new lock screen passcode, and your iPhone is back to you. You can do whatever you want with it, all right? So that's it. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to hit the like button down below. On top of that, also hit the subscribe button and the little bell icon to get notified whenever I post a new video. And last but not least, hit the comment box down below. Let me know what you thought about the tutorial, the process, the video, and my channel as a whole. I always do appreciate all your feedback. All right, so that's it. And I'll see you in the next video as usual. Bye-bye.